Hello everyone, I'm back with another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can install Windows 11 on VirtualBox. So that's been said, let's get started. In order to install Windows 11, you have to download two software. One is our VirtualBox where we are going to download our Windows 11 and another one is our Windows 11 ISO file. For that, just open your browser and visit virtualbox.org in order to download the VirtualBox. To download VirtualBox, simply click on this download link. Don't worry about the download link, you will get the download link in the description box. Here simply click on Windows Host. Here you can see it is downloading, it is around 183 MB. Let me cancel this download because I had already installed VirtualBox on my Windows 10 computer. If you don't know how you can install VirtualBox on Windows 10, we had already made a video, so the video link will be on the i button or you will get the video link in the description box. Now we have to download the Windows 11 ISO file. For that, visit this link. Don't worry about the link, you will get the link in the description box. This is the official Windows Insider Preview download page from where you can download all the preview version of Windows. In order to download Windows 11, you have to log in to your Windows Insider account. If you don't have your Windows Insider account, you can visit this link and you can register yourself on Windows Insider program. So hey, you can simply follow this link. Now just log into your Windows Insider program account and hey, you will find all the download links. Scroll down, here you will find a option to select your edition. We are going to download Windows 11 Insider Preview Beta Channel. Simply select this option and hey, Simply click on confirm. Now here simply select the language and here click on confirm. Here we have the download link of Windows 11 ISO file. Simply click on get 64 bit downloads and here you can see it is downloading Windows 11 Insider Preview Build ISO file which is around 5.1 GB. Let me cancel this download because I had already downloaded the Windows 11 ISO file. Now we have all the required tools. Now let me show you how you can install Windows 11 on VirtualBox. For that, let me close this browser and open VirtualBox. So here we have our VirtualBox. Here simply click on new and here name your machine. Say for example, Windows 11. So this is the location where your Windows 11 is going to install. And from the drop down menu, simply select Microsoft Windows and select Windows version as Windows 10. Here we don't have Windows 11 option. That's why we are going to select Windows 10 64 bit option. Now here click on next. Here we have to allocate our RAM size. Recommended is 2 GB, but I will suggest you to keep at least 4 GB of RAM. Say for example, if you have 8 GB of RAM on your main computer, then you can allocate 4 GB to the virtual box. Or if you have 16 GB RAM on your main computer, then you can assign 8 GB of RAM to your virtual box. So let me assign 4 GB of RAM, then click on next. Here simply select create a virtual hard disk now, then click on create. And here simply select virtual box disk image, then click on next. And here simply select dynamically allocated, then click on next. And here you have to allocate your virtual box hard disk size. So 50 GB is enough. So select 50 GB and click on create. So this is our virtual box machine configuration. Now we have to select the Windows 11 ISO file. For that, simply select your virtual box, then click on settings. Simply click on storage and here simply click on this empty option. Here you will find one CD icon. Simply click on this link and here click on choose a disk file and just select your Windows 11 ISO file then click on open. Now click on OK. We had selected our Windows 11 ISO file. Now it's time to start our virtual machine. Before that, let me tell you if you want to install Ubuntu operating system on your virtual box, then we already have a video. So the video link will be on the i button or you will get the video link in the description box. Now let us start our Windows 11 virtual box. For that, Simply select Windows 11, then click on Start. So here you can see our Windows 11 virtual box is running. Let me minimize this window. Here we have the Windows 11 setup page. Here simply select your language, then click on Next. And here simply click on Install. 
it will ask you a activation code you don't need to enter any activation code for that simply click on i don't have a product key and here select your windows 11 version we are going to install windows 11 pro 64 bit then click on next and here simply accept the license agreement from microsoft then click on next here we have two options one is upgrade and another one is custom simply click on the second option custom this is our virtual hard disk which is around 50 gb so we have to allocate this space simply select this space then click on next here you can see it is installing windows 11 on our virtual box while it's installing let me tell you something I'm suggesting you to install Windows 11 on your virtual box because Windows 11 is on beta version. It is not officially released or fully released for normal users. So before installing Windows 11 on your main system, I will suggest you to install Windows 11 on virtual box and try out the feature. And if you like Windows 11, then you can install on your main system. As Windows 11 is on beta version, it comes with bugs and other security issues. That's why it is better to install Windows 11 on VirtualBox to check out the new features of Windows 11. Our Windows 11 installation has been successfully completed. Now just select your country, then click on yes. And here simply select your keyboard layout. And if you want to add second keyboard layout, then you can add second keyboard layout. For now, I'm just going to skip this. It will automatically check for the update. While it's checking for the update, let me maximize the window. And here simply name your PC. Then click on next. Here simply select your uses. I'm going to use it for personal. And if you have a Microsoft account, then you can link to your Microsoft account. So let me link my Microsoft account. If you want to create a pin, you can simply create a pin. Then click on OK. Here we have some privacy setting. If you want to enable or disable some of the setting, then you can do it. Then click on accept. If you want to backup your file on OneDrive, then you can select this as we are using Windows 11 on our virtual box. So we are not going to backup our file. Simply select this option, then click on next. Here simply click on no thanks. Here you can see it is automatically updating to the Windows 11 newer version on virtual box. It will take some time. So wait until the update process complete. After it gets updated to the newer version of Windows 11, it will automatically reboot. So here you can see here we have the login page, simply enter your password. Here you can see we had successfully installed Windows 11 on our virtual box. Now let me show you how you can fix the resolution. To fix your resolution, simply click on this start button. Go to settings. On the system settings section, you will find display option, simply click on display. And here simply select your display resolution, then click on keep changes so this way you can install windows 11 on your virtual box so that's it for this video hope this video was helpful to you if you find this video helpful don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this bye for now see you next video